As we all know, every road we travel, every store we visit, and every flight we take has a carbon cost to it. This is the inevitable price we pay for a world built on energy-heavy industries, like transportation, like steel, like cement. The question, however, is how do we meet the demands of society and minimize global emissions at the same time? You might have heard the term industrial decarbonization. Put simply, it is the process of reducing greenhouse emissions from the world's largest industries. And some of them are much more difficult than the others. We call these hard to abate industries. Let's have a closer look at the cement production. Cement alone accounts for six to eight percent of all CO2 emissions, but more than 4.4 billion tons of it is used every year, which is enough to pave a concrete road that will circle the earth. And that's a lot of cement. While the need to lower emissions is clear, the path forward is complex and requires change from how we operate today. The change is difficult, especially when decarbonization projects face potential obstacles like the high initial cost, the technology readiness, and the ever-changing market dynamics. It's about steady progress. And no two paths to decarbonization are the same for hard to abate industries. Now let's go back to cement. The industry is already working to lower its energy consumption, exploring low carbon fuels like biomasses and optimizing their resources. But these efforts only address a fraction of the total emissions. A significant gap still remains. And this comes from the CO2 release directly from the core chemical reactions of the cement making process. This is where carbon capture, utilization, and storage, or CCUS as we like to call it, plays a very important role. CCUS technology prevents CO2 from entering the atmosphere and either storing it safely underground or repurposing it for things like the creation of synthetic fuels, creation of chemicals, or even for greenhouse horticulture. We are already seeing progress. The world's first carbon capture plant for the cement industry is already installed and it is designed to capture 400,000 metric tons of CO2 per year. How the world is developing through decarbonization is changing and CCUS plays a very important role in that transformation. It is not about stopping hard to abate industries for decarbonization. It is about making them cleaner and making their activities more sustainable. 